Welcome to the New Life Begins book project. This is where we are pushing past the old and embracing the new. We are so happy to have everyone on today. And today we have another special guest, Miss Natasha Sims. And Natasha, uh, so happy to have you on, first Thank of all. Um, tell us a little bit why you decided to do the book project, and then tell us about yourself and what you're doing. All right, well, my name is Natasha Sims, and I am 30 years old and a mother of four children. I recently graduated from Delaware State University with my bachelor's in social work. Um, the reason why I signed up for this, oh, and I do comedy on the side as well. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> the reason why I decided to do this is because, you know, God has placed a ministry inside of me to help others and to help women. To help young women and older women, women of all ages. And the things that I've been through in my life, as far as being married, being divorced, and everything else, um, God has used my life, God has used my, my life right now at this moment to help young women and to show them that you can come from the worst, you can do the worst, but he'll still make you the best. Um, that's the reason I signed up for this. Excellent, excellent. Now, I heard you say that uh, you learned a lot through life, through your life experiences and where you may have made mistakes. Um, a lot of people don't go to church now because they have made many mistakes. How do we get past our mistakes when we push past the old to get to the new? How did you do that in your life, like realistically? Realistically, I could not have done it by myself. It was God and God alone. When I accepted Jesus Christ into my life that day, um, and just being open to his word and reading it and seeing that there were so many other people in the Bible who were just like me and that I was not the only one going through the things that I went through, it made life a little bit easier. Um, just reading his word and just seeking God daily because, you know, a lot of times we want to do our own thing, we want to follow our own plans, but truly we have to follow God's plans in order for everything to go, go the right way. I know, that's right. <laughs> you just said something so true, and uh, sometimes we have to, I guess, understand, even in all of our lives, that when we do make mistakes, that all things work together yes. for the good, and that when God does something good in your life, yes. whatever bad you had, He can erase yes. it like never before. Yes. So we want to say thank you, Natasha, thank for you. being on today. May your part in this project show the people who have made so many mistakes, may they know that they can come back and that God would truly accept them for who they are. So thank you, Natasha. Thank you. You're so blessed. Thank you too. <laughs>